One, if you're a fan of the cult comedy series community, you might have noticed that a few familiar faces from Greendale have popped up in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Cool, 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 cool. In Captain America, The Winter Solider, we saw Danny Pudi Abed Nadir in a small role as a S.H.I.E.L.D. communications officer named Moore. It's also worth mentioning that Anthony and Joe Russo, who directed The Winter Solider, also directed the community pilot and several other classic episodes. In Captain America Civil War, another film from the Russo brothers, Jim Rash Dean Pelton dropped by as an M.I.T. liaison. Then in Spider-Man Homecoming, Donald Glover Troy Barnes made his MCU debut as Aaron Davis. On a side note, Joel McHale Jeff Winger had a cameo as a banker in Spider-Man 2, although that film's not part of the MCU. Also, Gillian Jacobs' Britta Perry appeared in an episode of Dan Harmon's Rick and Morty as Supernova, a member of the Vindicators, a superhero team that spends more time arguing that fighting crime, much like the Avengers. Outside of them, there are still a few community actors that have yet to appear in the MCU Alison Brie, Ken Jeong, Yvette Nicole Brown, etc. Seeing how this franchise has a long life ahead of it, though, it wouldn't be surprising if all of these actors showed up eventually. This begs the question, is the MCU building towards a community movie ever since Abed made a premonition about the short-lived superhero show The Cape? Fans have been demanding to see six seasons and a movie from the community gang. While we got the six seasons, a movie seems less likely. After all, community was never a ratings success and the whole cast has moved on to other projects. If we can get all the actors to join the MCU, however, it could make leeway for the community movie we've been dying to see, or at the very least a spiritual reunion. All the characters went their separate ways in the series finale. Wouldn't it be something if it turned out they all became watchers that are keeping an eye on the Avengers? Granted, that wouldn't make much sense, seeing how it's been established that the MCU is fictional in the community universe. As a matter of fact, Jeff and Annie referred to the Marvel movies as boring and flavorless in the last episode. Still, if the MCU actually made the community movie a reality, Chris Pratt could finally prove to Jeff that his muscles weren't digitally altered in Guardians of the Galaxy. And a movie, one.